Hi, I'm Tasma Monopoly, cosmetic chemist and trainer here at the Institute of Personal Care Science. And today I'm gonna to show you how to make a cream for sagging jowls on your face that comes with aging. Now let me show you how to put it together. Okay, so firstly here I have my phase A ingredients. I've got my water here and to this I'm gonna be adding the Pepo uh, vegetable water from Bioli. This has got some good anti-aging claims with it. And it's also an upcycled ingredient as well. So it's been created from what would normally get thrown out during production and made into something else. So it's been repurposed, which I absolutely love. Now, I am gonna be adding some of this Spec Bio Ectoin by Spec Chem. This is gonna help moisturize and plump the skin, but it's also got some anti-aging benefits in it as well. So I'm just gonna give that a bit of a stir to dissolve the Ectoin. It will need a bit of a stir in the water phase. It is heat tolerant as well. Okay, moving to our next phase here to help bring my cream together, I'm gonna to be slurring some Videscence Xanthum in some glycerin. Now you do wanna ensure that you do have a suitable humectant in your formula, especially for an anti-aging product, um, because as we age, we tend to lose obviously moisture and hydration, but we tend to have more trans epidermal water loss. So our skin's just not retaining moisture or hydration as well as what it used to. Okay, so we're gonna add that into our water phase. Give that a good stir. And you can see a nice homogenous gel has formed there. Now I am gonna pop that one on heat and while that's heating, I'm gonna to add together my oil face. So in here, I have some Olive M1000. This is a really good non-ionic emulsifier. It's waxy, so it's gonna help build some viscosity in our cream. To this, I'm gonna add some glycerol stearate citrate. This is an anionic emulsifier. It's in a powder form. This is also gonna help with viscosity and also stability. Next, I'm gonna be adding some caprylic capric triglycerides. This is a medium skin feel triglyceride. I'm gonna be adding some plant oil. So this is the Sedgesoft PFO by BASF. And just a small input of the Coco Caprylate by the Oleo Chemicals. This is a light feeling naturally derived ester. So you wanna have a good balance of light, medium and heavy skin feel lipids just to get that perfect skin feel. Now we're just gonna pop that one on heat also. Okay, once our oil phase is all melted, we're gonna put that into our hot water phase. You need to ensure that your water phase is hot enough before adding your oil phase, otherwise the waxy emulsifier won't stay molten when combined and you will get what we call waxy water, which is really hard to get rid of, so you generally need to start again. Okay, so nice emulsion has formed now. We're gonna remove that from the heat and we're just gonna keep stirring to cool that. Okay, so once that's cooled, now we're gonna go ahead and add in our heat sensitive materials. So firstly, I've got my active here. So this is this Phenox Lift by Evonik. Now I'm just pulling up the efficacy data on screen here. So this is made from Ceramide NP and it's in a powder form. So it's got a unique bioactive short chain ceramide that they've used to help tighten the skin and visibly lift face contours and also reduce the appearance of wrinkles. So you can see here in these two graphs, there was um, some testing done on 60 women aged between 50 and 70. Um, they applied the product with the active in it two days a week for 12 weeks on the face using the 0.2% of the active. 
And you can see here the results. There's a before and after application. So before and 12 weeks later, you can see there's a fourfold reduce in the wrinkle depth of the skin. And you can also see here the skin firming. So it's got a 2.2 fold higher skin density in the second photo here. So down below here, there's also some more efficacy data. It was the same test done on the same amount of women aged the same and also for 12 weeks. So you can see from the before and after photos here, there's been a massive improvement with the sagging jowls. Now what sagging jowls are is the skin that sits just above your jawbone and, this, and pretty much just below your cheekbone. So as we age, we lose that elasticity and it begins to start sagging below the jawline. And so you can see here a big improvement in just 12 weeks that it's reducing that saggy skin and visibly lifting that face contour upwards. So a great active to use there. Now I am gonna be adding some niacinamide as well. This is another good anti-aging active. It's uh, vitamin B3. So we're gonna add both of those in there. Uh, next, I've got my preservative. I'm using the Cosphoderm Multi-Meg by Cosphotec. This is a really good naturally derived preservative. I'm gonna be adding a little bit of essential oil. This is just a nice floral blend that I've got off the shelf. You can of course use your own. A glycerin base extract, I'm using aloe vera. This has got some good moisturizing and hydrating and soothing benefits. And last but not least, my antioxidant. So just some tocopherol here. Again, this is really good for skin benefits. It's got good oxidation protection for your skin so it protects from free radical damage um, that comes with aging as well and it also protects the formula from oxidation so we're just going to give that a good stir so then make sure you check and adjust your final ph and cover and leave it to sit overnight Okay, so here's what my cream is looking like the next day. Now you can see that's thickened up really nicely. It's got a really nice gloss and shine to it. Now a little bit goes a long way. It feels really nice and buttery. So it's really got some nice slip there. It's easy to spread and it's really nice and soft, non-tacky also and feels really moisturizing and emollient. Well, there you go. That's how easy it is to create a cream for those sagging jowls. If you enjoyed today's video, please give it a thumbs up. Leave any questions in the comments below. And of course, don't forget to subscribe to receive notification on the rest of our videos. Happy formulating.